Hey, what's up? See you guys made it to my crib. Place where I'm gonna be staying for the next few moments of life. My locks don't work, but it's okay. Got this little cool gadget right here to go. Woo! So the coyotes don't get us. And now you have my workspace. This is where I edit the vlogs and stuff that I give to you guys. Um, a phone, some light, because you know it gets dark in the desert, so you tap off, tap on, sort of thing. And then I'm gonna bring you over here to my my lovely, um, what is that? That's not a full 180. It's maybe like a 175 um, panel view of all this stuff that I um, that's on the compound. Those are my neighbors and their bubbles, you know. Man, I'd rather be a little higher than love coyotes to get them first. Um, yeah, yeah. So outside, I don't know if you've seen these things. We have a nice little hammock, you know, for when we like to sit outside, fully clothed, and drink cola and um, freeze. Yeah, freeze, because, you know, desert. It's what you do on Mars Jr. Uh, also have a little nice little area to sit. And also freeze if you want to lay down and freeze. You can sit and freeze. Then I got some little jacuzzi, but it's under construction because it froze. Uh, but yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, number to the best, number to the best. That's the bedroom, we'll walk in there later. This is my nice little bathroom area. This is the vanity, you know. <laughs> This is the sink with a mirror. Sorry, the help don't yell at me like that again, okay? You got you a close zoom mirror. You got you a in your nose not your mirror. You got you some towels, some soap, complimentary, you know. They come and refresh this daily for you. I don't know if you know that. Um, you got a space heater if it still ain't warm enough for you. I may need to use that because right now it's looking like I ain't paid my electric bill, but you saw me turn off my light. So you know I'm paid. Uh, some towels, some shoes. Decent closet space, but you know, you're not really going outside much because again, freeze. So come, come on, come, 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 come. Let me, let me get the light for you because you know it's a little dark. Okay, come, 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 come. Let me show you guys the rest of my bathroom facilities. Yep, I got this nice little shower action going on. It's one person only. Um, you can't be a thick hoe and get in here. Hold on, that's somebody coming to help. Coming. You gotta close one and the other. shower um hopefully the water gets piping but it's been a minute since i've used the shower out in the wilderness because um again it's cold you don't want to you know get messed up in there and catch the ammonia or some shit or some just you know just no then if you you know you got to use the facilities facilities you come on around the corner a toilet for you to use out in the open. Out in the open. But it's around the corner. It's hidden as best as it can hide in this, you know, studio living arrangement of mine. Now I'm gonna take you guys to where the magic will happen once we merge the two. So, we had a little hiccup in our booking. You know, we didn't read, so please read your signs because when we signed those papers and made our uh, deposits and stuff, clearly didn't check. So here we, we have, you know, these two beds that will merge and become one. And we'll sleep peacefully under the... Under the, under the potential stars <laughs> that may come out um, over here because the clouds are moving. The, you know, people are praying, you know, to whoever they pray to. You know, their respective gods. And they're asking for there to be stars tonight because we're here for one night only. One night only. Come on, come baby, come on. But you know, there. But um, yeah. So that's that's it. That's about um the room. So now we're just gonna go have some grub over here at my nice fancy orange um 
recliner chairs, be careful not to bust your ass in them because they've been known to uh, claim a few people victim. The okay. Until next time, you guys be easy. Visit the bubble. Visit the bubble hotel. And you can stay in a life of luxury as well. You're welcome. Get your ass out now. Come on. You ain't gotta go home, but you gotta get the hell up out of here. Go now, go. Go now. Go now. Don't open this door before this one closes, okay? Bye. Bye. Um, a few things you should know about, you know, our stay at the Bubble Lux Hotel. We did for one night. We came from Petra down to Whitey Rum, which is about an hour and a half drive. We took a taxi. You've seen all that footage. Great. Um, so once you get there, you meet at like a pickup spot. And then there's a shuttle that drives you from the pickup spot over to each of the respective uh, lobbies for the two different hotels that are there. Uh, on the campgrounds, we paid about 350 bucks. Bit, bit, bit pricey, but it, it was for an experience. Um, for one night, we only stay for one night and get the, the $350. Y'all know we don't spend that kind of money for one night of anything. So, yeah, we did the one night stay. What comes included with that is your own uh, bubble, which has everything you've seen in the walkthrough a few moments ago. Um, there's also like this really huge bubble in the center almost of the campgrounds. And it has dining area, it has the lobby, it has facilities, it has like a, a restaurant. Pseudo, a pseudo restaurant. I don't want to say like a, a big thing yeah. and you think something. So more so like a cafe, as Amelia just said from behind the screen. Again, she was supposed to be the one doing these. Don't you guys recall that? Comment down if you recall that video where she was supposed to do these. Please comment so I cannot have to record these. Breakfast is included and dinner, dinner is included. We skip breakfast because we're not big breakfast people, but dinner was absolutely amazing. Like it's just like buffet style and it's, pretty much everything uh, Jordanian that you can think of is pretty much there to feast on. Um, if you don't care for that, they also have the little cafe which you can order from. About our experience, um, I think we kind of touched it in another video, just but just for one video's sake. Uh, we enjoyed it. I enjoyed it thoroughly. Did you enjoy it? It was really nice. I liked it. Enjoyed it. Okay. They have different activities on the campgrounds, which we did, and you guys saw. Was forced to do them, the so we course. didn't get a chance to. I actually could speak on that. The stargazing thing. We didn't get a chance to actually do the big stargazing thing with, like, at the lobby part of the um, Lux Hotel, Bubble Lux Hotel, because. It was shitty out. Like the weather was not agreeing. It was wet, rainy. It snowed on the way uh, to Wadi Rum, which is like <sighs> for us. Um, so we didn't get to see it, but hope was still there because in the middle of the night, the sky lit up. It was clear. You could see all the stars, and it was so nice. Really hard to capture on film, and I was not getting out of my bed to grab this. A camera to do so so since I couldn't figure it out on the iPhone because I don't have one of those fancier iPhones it's just gonna be a memory like Prince told Beyonce so many. if you have any additional questions um, Amelia can provide the answers to those in the comment section below if you guys ask them she will reply to the questions um, yeah so to the next one. Be easy. <laughs>